Guide to the Good Life has provided me with some opportunities to experience things that I'd never would have seen or been a part of in my life. Flying in a jet fighter was incredible. Learning about the intricacies of certain styles of cooking and getting out there and seeing how people enjoy themselves, it's been a great privilege. But one of the more memorable experiences happened on my very first episode. We did this story on a lady living up there in the Dandenongs and she had found the good life making jams and selling her products to the local community. But it just so happened Anne also had a couple of alpacas as pets. And we thought we needed to go down there and meet what we thought were friendly animals. Well, it just turned out that these animals were more friendly than expected. And one of them took a particular liking to myself. I told you he liked me. Aztec, easy fella, we've only just met. Let me tell you, it, uh, it's very difficult working with kids and animals, as they say, and I found out the hard way trying to do my piece to camera and the amount it takes it took to get this alpaca to behave itself, the spitting and the smell of an alpaca spit, absolutely putrid. We don't just dream it, do it. And on today's show, we'll show you how. That went in my mouth. So great fun learning about Anne. Great to learn a little bit about alpacas. And the thing that I can tell you is the alpaca spit. Well, it is putrid, stinks, and you never want to have anything to do with it.